we know that health is health. And healthy eating, healthy exercise creates a healthy skin. Right. We don't have that many specifics besides we know that carbohydrates are not good for the skin. We know that milk sugar is not good for the skin. Um, we're seeing a correlation now with adult acne and gluten. Mm -hmm. So we're learning things as we grow. But, you know, back to my company's name, Kutura. It's a culture of your skin. In other words, everybody's DNA is unique. And what might be good for me might not be good for someone else. Right. So we all have to kind of become our best doctors. We have to figure this out. But in terms of, of, of healthy foods, I just think common sense has to be applied. As good as a pizza is, <laughs> we know it's not good for right. us. As good as ice cream is, we know it's not good for right. us. So the right. same type of, of philosophy of salt and that, mm -hmm. we know. Right. But in terms of having a list of foods that are good and the bad, besides general categories, we know fruit is wonderful for our skin, for our health, for our bodies. Right. We know anything in moderation is appropriate. Right. We know fatty foods is not the greatest things we have. So again, but I think it's going to come down. You know, in Australia and England now, they have DNA swaps that are telling me about your skin. Wow. And your products are being made now based on your own DNA. Wow. Not based on looking at you and making assumptions. Mm -hmm. So the future of skincare is going to be a DNA based product. Interesting. That's going to be done specifically for your DNA, not for everyone's DNA. Wow. Yeah, so the takeaway is common sense. We all know that the cleaner your diet, the better your skin. I always recommend um, like lemon, like right here I'm drinking lemon yeah. water. Um, lemon, anything citrusy, yeah. you know, that vitamin C. Um, I love green tea. Um, I used to suffer from acne and actually had a little eruption, but in general, I don't deal with acne and stuff like that. Um, but, but yeah, so use common sense, clean diet, Usually it's going to equal beautiful skin and then also your treatments and... We also have a, a part of our consultation which is complimentary. We have a skin analyzer that will analyze your skin. Okay. It looks at how much bacteria you have on your skin. It looks at your pores. Are they clogged? Are they open? It looks at your complexion. Not just how even your color is, but how deep are the dark spots into your skin. Okay. It looks at texture, firmness. So we have, we have tools now that go beyond me looking at your skin. We use technology at Katura to really examine your skin. And that to me is priceless. So it gives you a baseline and a way to grade improvements. Okay. So again, it's not only the expertise, it's also the tools the experts have. Mm -hmm. The technology, I've never heard of that, mm -hmm. but that's cool. Yeah. That's cool.